The history of the battle tank goes back 100 years. In 1915, the British produced what is considered the first battle tank, named Little Willie. And by 1916, the British had a fleet of armored vehicles fitted with caterpillar tracks, known as the Mark I. The French, Germans, and Russians all soon had the early form of battle tank, although they bear little resemblance to the tanks of today. In 1917, America quickly realized it needed to start building tanks of its own. This heralded the mass production of the first U.S. tank, the M1917. Since then, the race has been on to create the perfect model of these heavily armored vehicles. In today's video, we will be comparing two of the most advanced tanks in the world, the Russian T-14 Armada and the American M1A2 Abrams. Both of these tanks are currently in active service with their respective countries and have been designed to provide unparalleled protection and firepower on the battlefield. The T-14 Armada The T-14 Armada is the first Russian main battle tank to have been developed in almost 40 years, and it is considered to be one of the most advanced tanks in the world. It features a completely new design that is based on a universal chassis, which can be used for other types of armored vehicles as well. The Armada's most striking feature is its unmanned turret, which is controlled from inside the tank by the crew, who are housed in a separate compartment that is heavily armored and protected against NBC, nuclear, biological, and chemical threats. The T-14 Armada has a crew of three, with the driver located in the hull and the gunner and commander in the turret. It is powered by a 1,500 horsepower engine that gives it a top speed of 80 kilometers per hour on the road and 60 kilometers per hour off-road. The Armada has a weight of 48 tons and is equipped with a variety of advanced features. The Armada's primary weapon is a 125 mm smoothbore cannon that is capable of firing a range of ammunition, including armor-piercing rounds and guided missiles. The cannon can fire at a rate of up to 12 rounds per minute and has a range of up to 7.5 kilometers. In addition, the Armada is equipped with a 7.62 mm coaxial machine gun and a 12.7 mm machine gun on top of the turret for close-in defense against infantry and light vehicles. The Armada's armor is made of composite materials that are designed to withstand a wide range of threats, including kinetic energy penetrators and explosive reactive armor. The tank also features an active protection system that uses radar to detect incoming threats and then deploys a countermeasure to neutralize them. The M1A2 Abrams It is a primary battle tank used by the United States military and has been in service since the 1980s. Over the years, it has undergone several upgrades to keep it at the forefront of tank technology. The latest version, the M1A2 SEP-3, is the most advanced and is designed to be highly mobile and versatile. The Abrams is powered by a gas turbine engine that gives it a top speed of 42 miles per hour on paved roads and 30 miles per hour off-road. It has a low profile and a 120 mm smoothbore cannon that is capable of firing a range of ammunition, including depleted uranium rounds and guided missiles. The cannon can fire at a rate of up to 10 rounds per minute and has a range of up to 4 kilometers. The tank is also equipped with a 7.62 mm coaxial machine gun and a 50 caliber machine gun on top of the turret for close-in defense. The Abrams armor is made of composite materials and depleted uranium, which provide excellent protection against a wide range of threats. The tank also features an active protection system that uses sensors and countermeasures to detect and neutralize incoming threats. Comparison When comparing these two tanks, it is clear that both have their strengths and weaknesses. The T-14 Armada is known for its advanced armor technology and active protection systems, which make it highly resistant to enemy fire. The Armada also has a superior fire control system that allows it to accurately target and engage enemy vehicles at long range. The M1A2 Abrams, on the other hand, is designed to be highly mobile and versatile. It has a low profile and can operate in a variety of environments, including urban areas and deserts. The Abrams also has a highly effective thermal imaging system that allows it to detect and engage enemy targets at night and in low light conditions. Both the Russian T-14 Armada and the American M1A2 Abrams are highly advanced tanks that are designed to provide superior firepower and protection on the battlefield. While the Armada may have superior armor technology and a more advanced fire control system, the Abrams is highly mobile and versatile, making it well-suited for a variety of combat environments. 
Ultimately, the effectiveness of these tanks will depend on a variety of factors, including the skill and training of the crews that operate them. Thanks for watching our video on the comparison between the T-14 Armada and the M1-2 Abrams tanks. We hope you found it informative and engaging. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more informative content like this. Also feel free to leave your thoughts and comments on this topic below. We'd love to hear your opinions and feedback.